What's up everyone and welcome back to Pixelmon on Pocket Pixels or should I say welcome to the start of a new series here in Pixelmon. I didn't think I would be coming back to this game anytime soon but for some reason I just didn't really feel like playing Minecraft. I've done a couple of Minecraft series in the past in case you guys are new here and didn't see my old Minecraft series and the latest one I've done was actually a mod called Pixelmon which is basically Pokemon in Minecraft. Now for those of you that do know about my Pixelmon series Welcome back! I'm finally back on the server. This is actually a server called Pocket Pixels, where we basically created an entire region of Pokemon full of gyms, Pokemon centers, as you can see, Pokemon Marts. Uh, that's actually the first gym right there, and we are now at the spawn of the server. So this is where you would begin if you came and played along. And if you guys didn't know about this server, it is actually a server I was owner with uh, Yoshida Mario. We created it about a year ago, and it's come a pretty long way. It did not look like this when we first started off, but some very awesome people that are really talented at Minecraft uh, built this awesome, awesome world. And now here we are. So welcome back, or welcome, whichever one it is, to Pixelmon. Oh man, I'm actually excited now. Now that the music is kicked in, I'm actually excited for this. So. Today, I actually, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I have no idea what I'm doing, to be honest. Uh, so I was hoping today to show off a little bit of the server um, and ask you guys what you think I should do here in Pixelmon because I really want to do a new series, but I'm not sure which one or what I want to do with it. Just an FYI, you can actually check out and play on the server if you do have Pixelmon already. Um, go to the link in the description, pocketpixels.net. You can check out the server there, uh, the IP address and everything, and if you want to download this mod, Pixelmon, which I'm going to show off a lot more of in a little bit, uh, you can do so as well in the description. I'll link all of that, but anyway, uh, if you guys are excited for a new Minecraft series here on my channel, since I haven't done one in so long, please be sure to leave a like down below. That way I can know how many people are interested in something like that, and uh, help me out with thinking of what to do, because I... I'm gonna, well, I have some ideas, I just don't know exactly which one to pick out, so anyway, um, this is what I was looking for, the warp room, but actually, let's go check out this town over here first, uh, but like I said, this is kind of, a, a custom or a fan-made region of Pokemon, you can see on the right side there, the open gym, Psychic Poison Rock, so let's go check out the rock gym, which is apparently, uh, open right now, so this is Mithridge Town, bridging the gap between the old and new. How nice, look at that. Bridging the gap, there's actually a lot of bridges around here. Uh, but what I was gonna say is, I, I don't know if I wanna like have multiple series going on. I think I just want one main Munchcraft series, which is what I used to call my Minecraft series. Um, and I mean, some episodes can be single player, some can be multiplayer with friends. I just, I don't know exactly uh, which direction to take it with. So I wanted to ask you guys which one you enjoyed the most. Those of you that watched my Minecraft series in the past, did you like the single player stuff more? Did you like when I came on the server and played with Yoshida Mario and uh, just hung out with uh, the people that are here? There's actually still some people here that are from back in the day. I know there's a lot of new players too though. Um, but this is the Rock Gym, as you can see, to the Rock Gym Spectator Area. Stand on this pad to teleport to the Spectator Area. Whoa, that, this, I can spectate from right here. Yo, look at this. I remember this place. I actually, I'm pretty sure this is like the only gym that me and Yoshida Mario managed to defeat. Uh, but yeah, you can see there's some rules for it and everything. Oh yeah, so I should probably show off a little bit more of the mod, huh? Let's get in this Pokemon Center and see if we can send out our Pokemon in here. No, I see it in the chat that it's sending it out. Oh, there we go. It's you, the level 16 little Radita. What a cute, what a little cutie. I like him. I don't exactly know what the last thing I was doing here was, uh, but I do remember some of my old series. One of them, whoa, this is really cool. It's like a map of the town. So if we're in the Pokemon Center, which is right here, that's the spawn. Okay, I was trying to figure out what that was. This is a really cool arena, it looks like. What is that up there? I don't know what that is, but I wanna check that out. Uh, but yeah, let's go check out the PC and see what kind of Pokemon I've got going on in here. Let's see what kind of shenanigans I was up to. I got it. Pompeii, Bailey, Kaisar, Hipster Space Princess Veronica. Oh, I remember that one. Claptrap, Graham, Broly. I called him Broly. Marshtomp, uh, Duchess, and Cat the Turtle. That makes sense. Hey, it's Fabby. Let's get Fabby going on in here. Actually, you know what? Let me get some other Pokemon. Wow, there's a lot of Pokemon here from my playthroughs. We got, uh... Gogglehead, Darwin I think was from my Heart Gold or Sacred Gold Nuzlocke, Pikachu the Raichu, what the heck, whoa, what, okay, pretty sure these aren't legit, but we'll bring him out anyway, there's an egg, 
Sebastian and Full. I think it was supposed to be Sebastian and Flounder, but whoa, we got a pretty OP team going on here. Let's send out Fabi. I think you can ride Pokemon, but I'm not sure if it's enabled on the server. Uh, but there's Fabi the Beast. Very, very cool, man. Uh, but yeah, basically I wanted to make this little introduction video just to let you know, you know, the server is still around and I'm trying to make a comeback to it. I really want to get back into Pixelmon, uh, but I'm not sure what you guys like want to see exactly. I know this is a really cool game. I think there's actually a new update for it as well, Pixelmon 4.0. Hey, you can basically battle anything that you see around and even catch them. I think I've got some Pokeballs, so we should try to fight this Mareep, see if we can catch it. Um, I mean, Fabi's pretty overpowered right now, so we'll just Willow a bit. And, uh, you know, little, little down, little by little. Cotton Spore, really? Why would you do such a thing to me? I'm gonna throw this Pokeball. There used to be this thing, uh, way back in the day. I don't think it's around anymore, but there'd be, like, this glitch where the- Oh! Pokeball actually shakes now. How many? Oh, we did it! We captured Mareep! Nice! That's cool, man. I see that the, the the mod itself has been updated a lot, which is really cool. I don't know if there's any new Pokemon or anything, but the, the mod itself looks a lot more, uh, less buggy, I guess, which is, which is a good thing. Here's a Sfeel. So cute, man. I could go back to the roots where I played kind of a single player series, but we could actually just do the single player series here on the server. I mean, I'm playing single player right now, just on a server, it seems like the spawn rates of Pokemon and everything have been uh, fixed by a lot, because usually, or before, there wouldn't be as many Pokemon walking around and stuff, but I think that's just because there were more players, I'm not really sure. Uh, but yeah, I could definitely do a single player sort of series on here, and start building my house and all that, and catching all the Pokemon, because right now I've got all of these items, uh, well, I think these are, I don't know what I have actually. Blaze powder? What even is that? Alright, dude, let's blaze it. Come on, let's blaze this slow king up. Yeah, come on, slow bro. You're a slow bro, not a slow king. What am I talking about? Can I not blaze up this slow king, bro? Ah, slow bro. Alright, you know what? Let's throw a Pokeball at it. Why the heck not? Now we get to watch it. Shake, shake, shake. It's probably gonna break out. Um, I don't really know where it went. Slow bro? Hello? Okay, well, it's dark now. I'm kind of scared, but this is apparently Route 1, and it's cool because there's uh, actually little Pokemon here like you'd find on the roots, except in this game, there's Pokemon everywhere. Uh, but the very first one I did back when I first installed Pixelmon, I just kind of wandered around and did it kind of like a regular Minecraft series. So I think it would be nice to go back and try to do something like that, you know, just start extremely from scratch. Put all of these Pokemon that I have away. Uh, get like a nice little starter Pokemon and just start leveling up from there trying to catch other stuff This game is actually really really complex since I was gonna just show stuff off in this first video just show off the server um, We'll go and run this way since we're on route one We could actually go back to the spawn and use that warp room that I showed off at the beginning to teleport to the various different gyms that we have set up but right now, only the Poison, Psychic, and Rock ones are open, and we were just at the Rock one. So we can see if maybe we can actually just walk over to the next gym. I don't think we can, but you can definitely try on the back of our Rayquaza! Oh, man, we can't fly on it to over... Wait, what? This Pokemon doesn't... This Pokemon belongs to me. Why is it saying I... What? Hello? Why is the chat saying that? Huh. I'm, I'm not really sure. Um, well, let's ignore that and uh, recall Rayquaza. I know you could fly on Pokemon, but I don't know if you can now. PvP over there. What? There's a PvP arena. That is cool. What is this building here, though? Yo, I'm going to check out the PvP arena. Actually, I've just remembered. I can fly! <laughs> that is one thing we've still got. We've got the power to fly away. Floors 1 and 2, potions, basement, enchantments. What? Man, I've forgotten everything about Minecraft. There's so much crazy stuff to do in this game. I just feel like I haven't been paying attention to it at all. Like, have they done new updates and stuff? I know that Microsoft, like, bought out Mojang or Minecraft itself or something like that. You got enchantments going on there. You got these enchanting tables. Put this iron sword in here and boom! I just enchanted it with knockback, baby. Look at that. I don't even know what that means. I guess it knocks stuff back further, but... I don't think regular mobs like zombies and pigs and all that spawn in Pixelmon, so I'm not sure what the utility of this would be. Oh wait, there's PvP, so I guess it would be for that, huh? Mr. Captain Redbeard, wait, what are these guys? What are these names? Oh, build credits. Ah, oh, 
Well, thank you to all of those awesome people for building this. You guys are awesome. Let's uh, let's fight a little Drift Bloom with Rayquaza. You know, that's not overpowered at all. Let's crunch it down. One thing I don't think is in here yet are Mega Evolutions, though, but they might be in the new update. I think there is a new update. I could just do... I think I might do a video eventually uh, of, the, of the new update just to see what's going on. I really need to catch up, though. I should have probably done that before this video. Might have been smarter if I caught up on what is new in Pixelmon before I jumped into it like this. Um, but this is... It looks like a PvP arena. I'm actually playing this really late at night. I should probably mention that. That's why you don't really see that many people around. But you can definitely see people typing in the chat right now. Um, and we could actually go check out and see where some of these guys are and go see what they're up to. Uh, but this is a cool PvP arena. It reminds me of back in the day when I used to play uh, those mini games with Yoshida Mario. There were a lot of really cool mini games that you used to be able to play in Minecraft. I'm sure they're still around. I just don't really play, so I wouldn't know. <laughs> but uh, let's see. Oh, we can't get out! Dang, the soul sand doesn't let you get out. I forgot about that. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. I've, uh, I've forgotten about this. Okay, so I think I'm going to go back to the spawn, and we're going to go check out some of the other towns that are around here. Uh, so you can see the rules and staff room, the warp room. Wait, am I over here? I don't even know if I would be in here, because it's like I said, I kind of abandoned the server, and I feel really bad that, that I did. Uh, but there's definitely still people here. Whoa. Hello. Um, you know, I know you're not a real, oh, uh, <laughs> that's not, that's not creepy, Mr. Sasuke-kun. Hello, Steven. Hmm, that's interesting. <laughs> I know those aren't real people, but it makes it look so, it's so creepy that they follow you and look at you like that. <laughs> uh, but over here, let's see, we got slash gym rules. Oh, here are all the water gyms, and it shows you, I think, all of the gym leaders or the people that have beat the gym. I think it's probably the people that have beat the gym. Oh, look at all the badges, too. That's awesome. You can flip those right around. I'm not going to do that, though. I guess all the badges are in the game, because they have even the Pokemon black and white ones. I don't think those used to be in it, so the game has definitely been updated. I just don't know how much. Hey, Ash Ketchum over there. I like that. All right, let's finally go to the warp room, though, which I've been talking about this entire time, uh, going to the uh, to the other gyms and checking those out. Oh. Um. Uh. Well, then. I don't, I don't think I was supposed to... Uh, see this. I'm sorry, dude. Alright, well, I guess the warp room is, uh, off limits, sort of. So, I'm not sure what is up with that, but we can probably still go to the other gyms by warping there. So, we'll try and do that, but finally, there's the donator room. Look at all these awesome heads of donators. Donators, I think, are people that purchase on the store on the website of the server. So, yeah, go check that out, like I said. But anyway, we're going to go uh, warp to Gym 2, which is Canopy Heights, patiently climbing towards success. Whoa, a wild Chikorita? What? That is crazy. How is there a wild Chikorita? That's awesome, man. Too bad it's going to die to my Stone Edge. Ah! Now, no one can have it. If I can't have the wild Chikorita, no one can. But this is very cool. There's a lot of Pokemon, and it's really cool that, you know, we're at a grass gym, and there's actually grass Pokemon and everything. I mean, that's just the mod and how it works, though. Like, it, Pokemon spawn depending on, like, what biome you're in. Then, as I say that, here's a Golbat and a Zubat right out in the middle of a flower field. So, uh, maybe not exactly, but it's pretty accurate with the way it does things. Like, you'll usually find... The one thing I like more, though, you won't find a horde of Zubats just over and over in a cave, so it's not like that. Uh, but this is the second gym, another town. Uh, whoa, dude. This is awesome, and I love the Pixelmon music. Why can't it be on all the time? I just freaking love the Pixelmon music. It's got a Lord of the Rings vibe to it, and guess what? The server actually, well, at least this gym town thing it has kind of a Lord of the Rings vibe to it, too. It just feels like this would fit in a medieval kind of a uh, setting sort of sci-fi medieval kind of thing treetop arena trainer tip this isn't the grass gym arena keep going oh this way to the grass gym all right i want to go to the grass gym wait is it down or oh th there's a garden shop oh so i guess it, it is more like a it's still like a little town there's still stuff going on here's a pokemart the jumping path <gasps> we gotta jump to it Oh my gosh, dude, I love parkour, and I just failed. Are you kidding me? 
I already failed your jumping course, man. Huh! Huh! Oh, this is so cool. I missed this, man. This parkour. Let's go up the ladder now. I remember, uh, what server did I used to play on? There was a server I used to play on that had a really, really crazy, uh, parkour thing. That was really awesome. I want to do that. Please have your badge out and visible for the gym leader. Uh, I have an HM for fly. Is that okay? Wait, he's not even here. I've just realized that. All right, let's move on to the next gym. Wowzers! Okay, I remember this one, actually. For some reason, I couldn't remember the other two, but I remember this one for sure. Or, sorry, I couldn't remember the second one. I remember the first one, too. This is Fume Fall City. City of Second Chances. Whoa. Second Chances is in, like, this entire city was corrupted somehow. And I remember this one as well, actually. I don't know if there's any new cities, though. I know that there's a lot of new stuff, but this is actually the Poison Gym. There's apparently someone here, according to the right side of the screen. So let's check it out and see if we actually see anyone in there. Hello? The music stopped, and every time it stops, I get so creeped out. I'm like, ah, what happened? Where did the music go? Now I'm all scared and alone in this Poison Gym. It's actually kind of dark in here, which makes it even creepier. But where's the arena in this one? I don't really see the arena in this one. Is it right there? Is that it? Oh, I think that is it. Is that someone? There's someone in there. I can't really tell. Oh. Never mind. Moving on. Gym number five, which is the psychic gym. And another one that's actually online right now. Oh, this was like my favorite city. Just because of all these really, really cool colored glass panels. I didn't know that those were in Minecraft when I first saw this city. So I was like, whoa, this is awesome. I know the last town also had them, but I didn't really notice what they were until this one. Um, but those are so cool, man. There's actually so many cool blocks in Minecraft now. Kind of just want to go and build some stuff in creative mode or something. That would be really cool. I always enjoy doing that, like just starting up a world and just trying to build something cool. Warp for spectators. All right, let's go in here. Whoa, this place is dark. Uh, I'm scared. I'm still scared because there's no music. I'll put my own music, man. There's another gym, though. The gym leaders themselves aren't in here, but I'm assuming that just means that they're online. So you can probably ask them in the chat. Uh, if you need a gym badge. Who needs the rock gym? Yeah, so look at that. Someone someone was asking there. I think that's actually might be the gym leader then. The lobby is this way. Ignore the hologram. The heck's the hologram? Oh, was it saying... Okay, never mind. My bad. Let's go to the lobby. I don't know what's in the lobby, but maybe we can check in. Maybe Mr. Mosby is there. Or Esteban to carry our luggage. Man, this is a pretty long walk that we have to go around to get to this lobby, huh? I don't know if I'm a big fan of this hotel. Wait, is this just, is this whole thing the lobby? Let's just go all the way around. What? I just found like a horde of Squirtles. Is this the Squirtle Squad? Squirtle Squad, why are you running away from me? Guys, I'm your friend. Look, I have a level 100 Mew. He's, he's cool. Come on, guys. Stop running away, please. Oh, they're so cute though, man. I want them all. Wouldn't be so cool if you could have a Squirtle with the Squirtle Squad sunglasses like in an actual Pokemon game. I think that would be awesome. Okay, seriously though, I don't think this hallway is leading us anywhere. So I'm just going to go to the last gym and check that out. And it looks like it is Lavish City where everyone goes broke. Holy crap. On a crap stick. What? I've never been here before, but oh my goodness. This is freaking crazy. What? Dude, I feel like Dorothy just got to Oz and the Emerald Castle is what it's called. I don't know. This is freaking cool though. Look at this town. What? This is so amazing. I think the fact that I can fly makes this a little bit unfair. Why is a Pikachu, like, I'm gonna push him off. Can I do that? Come on. Get down. Get down. Go! Oh! Oh, he actually fell. He didn't die, though. Oh my god, he almost lost all his HP. Wait, we can probably catch this thing now, then. Let's throw it at it. Come on! Pikachu! What? Is that a Staraptor? What the? Is that a wild Staraptor? What? It's got like an actual walking animation and everything. What? That is freaking sick. Why is it running away from me though? I think it's moonwalking. I think it might be moonwalking. Hmm. Fine, Staraptor. Don't be my friend. I see how it is. Seriously though, this is freaking amazing. 
I guess that's a giant, giant Pokemon Center. This reminds me, I guess it's supposed to be like the, the Castilia or the Lumios city of the of our region here. This is freaking sweet though. What? Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is crazy. Okay, I gotta... Uh, yeah, we made it up here. Wow, this is freaking cool. All right, dude, I, I got all excited now, so uh, definitely gonna be doing something, but let me know in the comments what you guys think uh, of all of the stuff that I mentioned, or if you have any other ideas. Maybe you think I should just catch some random Pokemon, maybe you think I should complete the Pokedex, um, or something like that. Just let me know in the comments, and I would really appreciate that. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, as always, be sure to leave a like, and I'll see you all in the future for some more Pixelmon. Gotta catch him all! Yeah.